All right, all right. We are on. Let's hit my damn part. Yes, we're on. Here we go, y'all. Well, this is it, you guys. I'm Pastor Thomas, and believe it or not, we are in week number 11. Week number 11. Whew. Wow, man. We are we're moving down the road in a very positive direction, and I'm excited to be your coach and to be on this journey with you. I appreciate you guys taking the challenge to be on this journey with me. Um, I just, I needed this, y'all. Y'all don't know how bad I needed this. I needed this to be able to have a goal put in front of me and then to say, you know what? In order for you to keep this goal, man, invite everybody. Let everybody in on it. Whoever wants to take the challenge to get it right before the end of this year, let them join. And that's what we're doing. We're letting them, we're letting everybody join. And I thank you guys. I thank you so much for joining the challenge. It's a good challenge. We're talking about diet, whatever diet you want uh, to get on, whether it's keto, whether it's fit for life, whatever diet you're choosing to be on, that's the diet that you want. Uh, maybe you're just saying, hey, Thomas, all I'm going to do is cut out sugar. That's fine. I'm cutting out chips. I'm cutting out pop. I'm cutting out this. Whatever you de you decide to be on, whatever decide uh, diet you decide to be on, that's what diet you decide to be on. I'm good with that. I'm going a little hard because I need to go real hard. Um, I, I have to be truthful with you with this whole diet thing. I have to be truthful. I when COVID hit. Man, I, I was working out. I was I was juicing. I was doing all the things that I normally do and everything was going well. And then all of a sudden, uh, when when COVID hit, uh, it just it felt like um, it felt like my world just kind of caved in in terms of my workouts. Uh, they, they, you know, they shut the gyms down, couldn't go into gyms anymore. And so that I started working out at home and then. One day I got up and I, I, I worked out, uh, Sister Butler, and when I, when I did work out, uh, I pulled a muscle, and man, that took me out, and then I just started eating bad and worse and worse and bad, and, and you know, then I picked up a bunch of weight, so, um, you know, so I don't have anybody to blame but myself, and so I said, you know what, I'm getting it together before the end of this year. And that's how this challenge came about. It's not a religious fast. It's not about the church. It's not about, it's not about, you know, um, you making this commitment toward God. Like we know when we fast, how we do y'all, this is about, this is between you and you, you versus you. Right. So, you know, exercise is important. And then also personal enrichment. I made a lot of breakthroughs on today with, uh, with my uh, personal enrichment, my personal enrichment, uh, Sister Butler is is technology, and man, I made some strides on technology. If you could see some of the the flyers that I put out and some of the things that I did today, man, I'm I'm just amazing me because you know it's just coming so so easy and so quickly to me, and I'm just I'm just I'm thankful. I'm grateful, right? Okay, so all right, uh, we got we have this is day eleven. This day 11, we have 13 days to go because we're stopping. Our 25th day is actually Christmas. So we're stopping on Christmas. We're stopping on Christmas. So we have we have um, 13 days to go, right? Today is going to be our last vlog for the week because we, you know, we take off Saturday, take off Sunday because I got I got to prep for Sunday and then Sunday I got to preach and then I'll be exhausted by the time I'm done with all that. And so I'll be back Monday. I'll be back Monday with our daily vlogs. I'll be back Monday with our daily vlogs. All right. Look like we got some respondents coming here today. Oh, got a couple of amens in there. Thank you. Thank you, Sister Black. Thank you, Sister Black, for that amen. And thank you, Sister Butler, for that a for that amen. And and you know, y'all see stuff like this that I'm I'm doing things like this on the screen. That is, that's that whole technology piece. The first day that we did this, I didn't have the 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 comments open. Didn't even know how to work the comments, but I said, Lord, show me how to do it. Show me what to do. 
and then we went, we came back and boom, now we got comments and, and you know, it's, it's interactive. It's interactive. Okay. All right. Let me give you this and then I'm gonna get out of your way because I don't want to be before you long because I want you guys to keep coming back. I want you guys to keep watching, keep watching, keep sharing, keep, you know, keep, um, encouraging family members to get in on, on this challenge. It's, it's doable now at 25 days. You know, a lot of people, they, they were scared at 25. I got, I got to eat. I got to eat, Pastor. You just don't know I got to eat some bad stuff. <laughs> Listen, man, that's what's wrong with us. We, 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 we build shrines around, around food. We make, we make food sacred, right? And, and, and it, it shouldn't be that way. We should, we have to be in control of food. We have to ca cause food to yield to us and say, you know what? No, I'm not eating that today. No, I'm not eating that today. I I'm going to have some willpower. I'm going to fight back today, right? I'm going to fight. I'm going to take control. Food is not going to control me, right? I don't have to pull in Wendy's. I don't, I don't have to pull in the, uh, the crack chicken store. I don't have to do that, right? I'm going to make some choices for my own eating, all right? And so, uh, I thank God for you because you have said, mm, I'm fighting back. I'm accepting the challenge, right? All right, so let me give you this. Let me give you this, and then let me get out of your way. Uh, Sister Butler said uh, she's been uh, she's been going since October 1st. Wow, she's been going at it since October 1st. That is awesome, Sister Butler. All right, and and Sister Deb, Deb Black, she just agreeing. She said, that's right, that's right. All right, so let me give you this, and then I'm going to get out of y'all way. Let me give you this, and I'm going to get out of y'all way for the night, okay? All right, so we're going to go hard, right? We're going to go hard. So my, my thought for tonight is this. Go hard. That's my thought. Go hard. What happened today in your workout, Thomas? Why? What, 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 what brought this on? Well, somebody put that, on a, put that in the chat. Put that in the chat. Go hard. Put that in the chat. Go hard. Because I'm going I'm to pull it up in the comments and uh, that it'll be in our permanent record. Go hard. That's what we're doing today. We're going to go hard. We're going to go hard, right? Go hard. Well, what happened today in my workout is that I felt better today working out than I have in a very, very long time. And so when I, um, when I started working out, I, I picked, <laughs> I gotta be, I gotta, I, you know, I gotta be transparent. I picked a workout on the cycle today that I thought was going to be kind of easy. Right. And so these ladies, you know, it was these ladies, a cycle workout with these ladies. I said, ah, we, we should, we, we should be, we should be, uh, we, we should be all right with, uh, with this, with this workout. So I jumped on that bike and I started rolling with those ladies and sister black, those ladies start leaving me. I said, Lord, have mercy. They was going, we going, now we getting, we going hard for 15 seconds. Okay. Go harder for 15 seconds. You know, go harder for 15 more seconds. I was like, Oh my God, they was killing me. They was killing me, but my body was feeling good. My mind was feeling good because I've been eating right. I've been exercising. I've been, I've been doing all my personal enrichment. So I was feeling good. And so I kept pushing and kept pushing. And all I could think about as I was pushing today, y'all was I got to go hard. I got to go hard. And so I haven't been able to go hard like that with a workout in a long time. And so it felt good, Lenores. It felt good to just be able to get on that bike and to go hard like that. I, I was able to get my weight workout in, went hard with my weights. And I'm not talking about going hard to a point where you hurt yourself or you, you're killing yourself, but you go hard to that point where you know, Hey man, this is a good workout right here. I got a good one going and I had a good one going today. Right. And so this is what I need you to do. I need you on these next two days, Saturday and Sunday. I need you to go hard. I need you to go hard. I don't, don't back up. Don't ease back. Don't, don't allow Saturday to get you. Don't allow Sunday to get you go hard. If you need to increase your diet, increase your diet. It, it, when, I, when I mean, what I mean by that is if you need to go harder with your diet, set the goal higher. If you set your goal higher for your diet, then everything is going to work itself out, right? If you lower the bar, then you even go lower than you lower the bar, right? Because once we start, once we get off, then we really go down into the deep end, right? So set your goals higher, go harder this weekend, because when we come back on Monday 
after we get through Monday, we're only going to have 10 days to go. And now, and now a lot of those people who say, I can't do 25 days. Maybe now they'll jump on and do 10 days with us. Maybe they'll jump on and do that last seven days with us. But this is what I need you guys to do. I need you guys to go hard. Thank y'all so much. Thank you, Deborah. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming. I appreciate all you guys who came today and got and jumped on live with me today. I really do appreciate it today. All right. That's all I have. That's all I have for today. I just wanted to, uh, to come encourage your heart and let you know I will not be here going live on Saturday. We'll not be going live on uh, Sunday. I'll be back going live on Monday. All right. That's all I have. May the good Lord keep you. May heaven smile upon you. That is my prayer. Love you guys. Have a blessed day.